This is my final vlog post for my cinema class. And the movie that I chose to talk about was Broken Flowers, starring Bill Murray, directed by Jim Jarmusch. This movie was completely different from all the other movies we watched in class. And it focused a lot on how the actors portrayed themselves without saying anything. Specifically, the uses of silence and looking at the actors' facial expressions. So, to start this movie, Bill Murray is kind of floundering around his house, and he doesn't really know what he's doing with his life because all these women keep leaving him. He gets a letter in the mail, and the letter says that he has a son somewhere out there, and he's not sure if he really wants to go find the son or not, because, it, you know, it probably he probably has a son. But his neighbor convinces him that this is something that he really wants to do to get him out of his slump and bring him back to where he was. So he decides to go on this journey. Now throughout this journey, he meets four women in particular. And these four women could all be the mother of his son he doesn't really know. And so when he meets these women, he uses a lot of small talk and just kind of beats around the bush, doesn't really want to ask the question of if, you know, you are the mother of my child. During these questions that he asks, the director uses a lot of different cues and different things so you can understand what the, what the actors are feeling, specifically through his use of silence. Now, first off, there's a specific thing that I want to talk about, and that's the second woman that Bill Murray's character, Don Johnson, meets. He's in her house, and her husband shows up. They all decide to sit down and have dinner. And Jim Jarmusch uses a full shot of them all sitting at a table having dinner together. And you can see that the questions that Bill Murray is asking are kind of agitating the other two people at the table. You know, they don't really know how to answer, especially the woman. And so when he brings up children, you can just feel the tension in the room just increase immensely. Specifically through them not responding to the question. They sit there in silence, just looking at each other. And you can feel the awkwardness in the room. Also, he uses a lot of close-up shots, where when Bill Murray asks a question to the woman, they close in on her face, and all you can see is how she reacts to the question that he's asking. You know, he says something about, oh, have you had any children? And, you know, they kind of act as surprised. And, especially with the second woman, you can see that, you know, maybe she still has feelings for Bill Murray. She doesn't say this but you can just see it by the way she reacts with her body and with her face. Now, this movie really requires you to be an active participant in the audience because of all the small, subtle things that you have to pick up on. In other movies, you know, you can sit back, be a passive audience member, and just watch what's going on. But in this movie, you have to be actively paying attention because even when the actors aren't saying anything to each other, they're really showing a lot of what's going to happen giving a lot of insight into what they're thinking, and it really lays the foundation for the rest of the movie going forward. That's all I want to talk about. Thanks.